What's your boy, Stevie, and I'm here with Rico. All right, Rico, I got one question for you. So if you were standing in front of God right now and you could only ask him one question, what would it be and why? To be honest, I would ask him why do he pick me the stuff that I go through. Yeah, I know his intentions is good, but, you know, sometimes we can't handle what he put on us. But at the same time, he's not going to throw anything that he don't think we can handle, if that makes sense. I would just say, you know, that, you know, sometimes, you know, the reason why we go through certain things because it'd be like, you know, you know, the consequences of our actions, you know. We have free will and God gives us the choices to make, you know, to go left or to go right. Sometimes we start off in the wrong direction that is out of the will of God and that is out of our quote unquote flesh. And then that leads to destruction or that leads to our demise. But God wants us to, you know, go on a straight, narrow path, which leads to life. He wants us to go on a straight, narrow path, which is the plan and which is the um the destiny that he has for our life and that he is already, you know, predestined for us, you know, since the beginning of time. Before we was even formed in our mother's womb, he knew us. So the Lord just wants us to, you know, you know, just continuously like, you know, stay focused on him and just allow for ourselves to follow his will because God knows what's best for us. And he knows, you know, what he has in store for us. He knows who he is, has has created us to be. Yo, what's good? It's your boy Steven. I'm here with Nadia. I got a question for you. So what do you think is the true meaning of life? True meaning of life? I would say, I ain't gonna lie, for me, the true meaning of life is just making it worthwhile and respecting yourself. The true meaning of my life is just doing everything that makes me positive, like makes me have a positive day, pretty much. Loving, accepting, happiness, wake up with a smile on your face, you know. So, do you believe that there is a God out there somewhere? You know, do you believe that there is a God? I do. I believe there is a God for sure. Um, I wouldn't consider myself religious. But I do believe that there is a God. I do believe there's a higher power. Because I don't know, I had a lot of awakenings this summer. And yeah. it definitely helped me see a bigger picture to that. I always tell people it's not about religion, mm -hmm. but it's about relationship. God literally sent his son, Jesus Christ, and he came down here on earth as as flesh, as 100% human, 100% God. You know, he preached, you know, relationship. You know, he preached, you know, um, repentance. He came, you know down here you know to be the example because us humans you know we sin so we all fall short so god had to really come down and intervene and become you know you know become flesh he lived a sinless you know uh perfect life he died on the cross for our sins so that you know we won't so we won't be able to perish because god knew that there was no way we could be able to make it to heaven you know through our good works or you know just through like you know um you know, just do any like, you know, sacrifices like in the Old Testament, like they had to sacrifice animals for forgiveness. That was working for God's forgiveness. You know, Jesus paid a price on the cross and he died and, you know, he rose up. He defeated death on the cross. So how you feel about that? I mean, that's some facts. Shit, I can't disagree with that. Because, yeah, like you said, like, I feel like when it, as far as like religion, like so many different religions have their own views on things. But then it's like at the end of the day, it. If if y'all are preaching the same thing for real, God came, He created us all. So why why would He hate one group? Why would He hate this group? Why would He? You know what I'm saying? That's why when people match God with religion and they they like get on you for not picking a certain religion, it's kind of hard because it's like it, I, I don't know, like it's hard to really say. But I definitely know? agree because you know God definitely been like on me a lot, mm -hmm. like about like religion. Like He said, like you know. My children got to get out of the, you know, the legalistic ways. It's not about rules, not yeah. regulations. It's about a simple, like, relationship. All God yeah. wants us to do is just come to him, surrender ourselves, and just, you know, and just really just, you know, humble ourselves mm -hmm. so that he can be able to, you know, come into our lives and he can renew our minds, renew our hearts, right, yeah. and he could do, like, a work in us. Right, we shout now Mick Millions. Come check us out, Mall of America. Sure. We're going to have a lot of new stuff for Black Friday. Come support your local businesses.